Hey guys, our leg order just came in. Let's see what we got. Good old burger truck. Had to get that for the city. But speaking of food trucks, yeah, there you are. Two of those. Awesome, awesome set here. Look at all those figs for only $30. It's crazy. What is Star Wars thinking, you know? I am a slave to anything X-Men 97. As you can see, the gunship is also in there. Our pick-a-brick order. So hyped. Two boxes of our CMFs. Let's pop them open and see what we got. All right. So we got a lot of the series in the bags here that we got. Or boxes, I should say. Just missing three. So we'll see if we could trade. We got a couple extra. I was surprised. I was expecting to hit a lot more duplicates than I did. So only hitting three duplicates out of 12 was really good. By the way, I also hate the boxes. <laughs> I do miss the bags. It was always fun to go for a drop, you know, with everybody else there, you know, feeling what we need. But you know what? It's not here anymore, so it doesn't matter. But we got these series here, which is pretty cool. I don't know. I think so far out of these guys, I mean, this is really, I really love this mushroom head guy. <laughs> Or this kid, girl, whatever it is. A really cool piece. Alright, let's take a look at what else we ordered here. So the pick a brick bag came through really well. I did notice that I did not get my knob pieces. So we'll reach out to customer service. It's really good about coming through. But it's looking good. Uh, I'm running out of these guys here. But I'm going to get them at the Lego store tomorrow. Fill in this last row here. We can finally put this guy in there. Which a lot of progress has been made. We got the roof. Or the second floor. Roof is currently being worked on. <coughs> Wife is doing a pretty good job on there. And we got the course on guard ship. I think I already showed you guys this earlier. Some of the other purchases here. Just got off an auction. So we have some more stuff coming in. Always have something coming in. It's a bad habit of mine. Um, so we need to focus on the next phase of display. So I think our next one, we're going to go with a shelf, another shelf here. Um, I'm going to look into it. I don't know if I want to keep the same kind or maybe something bigger. And I don't know if I want it to be like a bigger bookshelf. Um, we'll do maybe hit up the internet and get some inspiration here. Uh, once we get it, we'll organize it probably by... Uh, timeline, Star Wars timeline. So we'll do that. And uh, yeah, it's looking pretty good. Let's get everything else cleaned up and then we'll go back to the city with the roads. I think the road plates will be the next thing that we work on here. I'll be able to fill out the sidewalks here with our pick a brick build. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and do that now so we can see what it looks like. Okay, first off, we did get the Mills plate complete. I was one short, so I had to improvise there. But that's okay because it will be covered up by the actual house. I'm never really worried about the actual what is here on top because it's usually covered up by something else, whether it be tile or whatever you're doing. So it rarely matters what you have right there for your base. Um, I'm sure there's certain cases where it would help Maybe you're building like a snowy village or something and just white is just easier because you might have those extra spaces. But for me, most of the time it's going to be covered up. And here I do like the gray, so I might have something out and showing. And so, but this part right here will definitely be covered up. No problem here. Like, take a little, let me put, hold on. So that's just with the house on top. I didn't use it as the actual base, probably because I'll... I'll have it more lifted, maybe even some more snow around it. Who knows? But you can see the improvised pieces are covered up. Um, I might even move it forward a little bit because I know we're not we're still building it, obviously. And I know it comes with, like, the tree house and everything else. So we'll see. Once everything's built, we'll get it all placed. And if I absolutely need a gray piece, I'll be making more pick-a-brick orders anyway. So, but also... I was just playing around with uh, the tile pieces here. Now, with my pick-up recorder, I don't know if I mentioned 
because I record these in little increments. Uh, my knob one by one pieces did not come with my order. So I reached out to Lego, see if they can get it resent for me here. Um, but that's okay. I just wanted to put these down to see what it would look like. Uh, I decided to use the uh, 80s bowling alley here. And so this is actually half of a Mills plate here. So I stopped where we would put the road plate and continue on there. Um, and I also didn't think about it, but these are like, uh, what are this? Uh, one, two by threes, two by three pieces. So it's a very odd shape which leaves like this line here. So I might just put like the, the flat tiles there to cover those up. And um, obviously even we'll put the, the knob pieces in some of these places too. I just didn't think about it. So we'll see how it shapes up. Um, if we're gonna keep it that way or if we do keep it that way, I might can in the future order um, maybe two by fours. I couldn't get two by twos in this color. That's why I had to go with something alternative. So we will see how that shapes up here. Um, oh, and the mail did come again while we were putting all this together. Let me show you. All right. So today's mail brought us the Cloud Rider Swoop Bikes. Really excited about the figs in here. Tobias, Entries, and Weasel. I, I don't know. I, I actually really loved Solo. And... Love the solo sets. So there's still some more that is on my list to get. Also, um, <laughs> the seller was all I always look to see what other because I buy from sellers and so I see, you know, I order them so I see what else they might have that I could bundle in because you know you pay shipping and everything. So I saw this awesome uh, Wonder Woman set here, which comes with all three. I love this version of Wonder Woman here. I actually didn't even know this one existed here. But it looks pretty crazy. But pretty cool. I, I, I really, really love this one. So I threw that in when I was originally getting the Solo one here. So I also found that the tiles that I use for the big mills plate don't really necessarily fit the sidewalk here to fill in the other part. So I'll have to order some different sizes there. Uh, I need to see if overall regular Mills plate will fit it. If so, we'll continue to order those to fill our regular plates here and just add to the order some different ones for the sidewalk there so we can finish that there. But uh, I'm I'm really happy with uh, the half sidewalk. So I'm, I think the overall success of kind of like extending the sidewalk with a road piece right there, I think that's going to be really good. Um, so I'll probably just continue to order those pieces from the pick-a-brick section there. And yeah, that's going to be it. I got this from the Lego store just because, I don't know if I ever showed you guys this set. They had a bunch of the, this guy is here. So I figured that's probably great for, uh, water. And so I, probably for the, uh, the water wheel thing with the hocus pocus as soon as we get that next table we'll extend kind of the forest area i think and that's where the water is going to really come into play um but next up like i said we'll get another another one of these guys here not sure if that it'll be the exact same one but we'll see um i just order, <laughs> ordered my kids some new beds so um after that we'll order another display case here get some more stuff up as, as you can see it's kind of a mess in here so i gotta tidy up guys so thank you again for joining and he's just hearing me ramble about lego um yeah if uh you guys have any questions or just even just overall opinions i love talking about lego and with other lego enthusiasts so drop a comment um and we'll see you guys next time guys take care of yourself out there